A.D. Taylor. This back you can tell both of these fighters are exuding confidence as they touch gloves. And here we go. So, all the talking's done. Now, let's get down to action. Thousands of fans here in attendance tonight, but when the bell rings, there will only be two that we're talking about. They ring the bell, and here we go. Unlucky to miss with that uppercut. These two were made for each other. Can't land the jab there. Katie Taylor looked like she was on her way to beating Jessica McCaskill fairly easy back in 2017. But in the second half of the fight, McCaskill turned things on. Jessica McCaskill, Katie Taylor. Now let's look at this fight. The first fight, they fought 10 rounds. Katie Taylor was sharp, beat it to the punch every time. The back end of the fight, that's when she started to wail a bit. That's when people at ringside say she loses it. What's happening here? That's when McCaskill came back, started to pull back the fight, making Taylor have to really dig in deep and get it. But Taylor's timing is everything. She knew when to turn it on the last minute of each round, the last 30 seconds of each round, towards the back end. But it was obvious she was timing towards the end. Are these signs? Are these signs of a, a tiring fighter? We don't know, but I tell you this. Taylor needs to be on her A game. Otherwise, he's going to slip away. The winner of this surely will get a world title shot. Beautiful counter punch. There's a counter shot. Someone, t despite what the judges' scorecards read, there are no losers in this one. Talk about Katie Taylor in that last round. Well, we know they've got the advantage so far, but how does this match get turned around? Dominance, without a doubt, made it look so, so easy. The referee calling for seconds out as we get set to jump back in the action. We're hoping for an all-action slugfest. She's coming off a fantastic last round. Let's see what she's going to do here. Todd, my motto is, if it's not broken, why change it? An excellent last round. Everything works. Wait for the reaction. Until then, she's doing what you've just been doing because you've won that hands down. One of the hottest tickets around. It's standing room only for this, our main event. It's so hot, it's so heated. There's a roof on here. You don't understand. When you're working, when the noise is there, the pressure's on, you're thirsty, you're sweating, and you're getting under. You're on the wrong side of a beating. This can be hell fire on you. They exchange punches. Incredible work rate. Nice counter shot by her. And down goes Katie Taylor. She knocked the wind out of her and it took her off her feet. Look at this replay. I've got to see that again.
We're at the halfway point, there's no doubt who's won this round so far. Well, she's back up, but what does she have to do to get back into this fight? The corner needs to think nice and sharp. They know their fight. They know what their fight is capable of doing and what their fight can and cannot say. This is going to be a tough decision to make. That is a show of character. When you're put down, your regal's hurt, your chin's hurt, your body's hurting, and you've got to get up, suck it up, and think, right, I'm back in the game again. It's so, so hard for a fighter. Final 10 seconds here, and it's been a good round for her, for sure. about Katie Taylor in that last round. That'll be a 10-8 round for sure with the knockdown. Can make or break a fighter. And there's the bell to start the round. They really got banged up last round. What can they do here to change the momentum? What a heavy knockdown. How are they going to come back from that? They staggered back to the corner. They've got to freshen them up, alert them again, get them back on point again. This round, they've got to coast around. Don't get involved. Give yourself another three minutes to get your head through. They exchange punches. Just when you thought we'd see a lull in the action, here we go again. Johnny, you would know this better than me, but I would hate fighting someone with this swarmer style. They don't let you breathe. They don't. Oh, McCaskill might get knocked out. No, we don't see a knockdown. Now they've got to wake up. They've got to get on the back foot, clear the head a little bit, then jump back into it again. It's all about the hustle. Get back on it. We're at the halfway point of this round, and both of these fighters have had their moments. Still could go either way. Very close match. It shows the skill, the discipline, the respect both fighters have for each other, because no one dare do anything out of turn. Swing and a miss with that hook. Nice counter. Oh, we rarely see McCaskill hurt, but she is now. How are they still standing? Green Days now needs to steady the pace. Get the pace back to... Very close round with 10 seconds to go. Counterpunch. Talk about Katie Taylor in that last round. Well, let's see what the corner has to say. She and there's the bell to start the round. That corner has got to find a way to get some momentum behind their fighter. They've had one minute to recover. Now they've got to bluff it. They've got to bluff it. They've got to come out now and style it out. Get on the back foot. Jab. Rest on the jab. Be smart and pop until your legs come back. Then put the pressure on. Straight right, just misses. This counterfighter believes in me. Anything you can do, I can do better. They'll let you throw a punch first, and they'll answer you, and usually hit you harder. You're fighting a counterpuncher, you've got a dummy a shot. Make them react from that, then react them. I know it's hard to think that way, but counterpunchers, they're watching you, watching your every move, that every twitch. time they throw a shot they get countered you'd like to see someone use a jab here to establish a boxing presence but no they just want to fight just miss with that jab a perfect counter shot nice counter Willing to go where the other fighter won't. The straight right just misses. Good counter shot by her. You know the scorecards are going to be all over. We rarely see McCaskill hurt, but she is here. What a shot! Down goes Jessica.
to come. You could see it in their eyes. They saw that punch coming, and there was nothing they could do. Shot from the gods, they say. A shot from the gods. Talk about McCaskill in that last round. Let's see how the game plan changes after that big knockdown. You've been put down. You've got to think right, survive, and then give it back the next round. We're hoping for an all-action slugfest. Desperate times call for desperate measures, Johnny. She just got dropped in that last round. Got to change something in the game plan here to turn this around. What a knockdown. One minute, you need one hour to get over a shot like that. Now it's down to conditioning. Now it's down to mental strength and preparation. It's how you are going to deal with this. Shot by her. Oh, McCaskill just got caught. She's in trouble. Now look at me. Look at me. Didn't wait long to get back and get engaged. Defense, defense, defense is everything because they got shot once. They know they can get caught again. So for now, just defense. Work on defense. Blocking and stopping and shooting. Exchanges from both women in this round. You cannot ever, ever compare anything to this. These guys really mean it. These guys must hate each other the way they're fighting. This fighter expending a lot of energy in this round. McCaskill stumbling backwards. She's in real trouble. They somehow weathered the storm. It's been a tough round so far. It's been a tough, tough round. What did they do? What did they tell him when he goes back? Like... Oh, McCaskill might get knocked out. <laughs> a very competitive round with 10 seconds left. How about that time counter shot? Talk about Katie Tick. They ring the bell, and here we go. After a really strong round, let's see if they can finish the job. Todd, my motto is, if it's not broken, why change it? An excellent last round. Everything works. Wait for the reaction. Oh, we rarely see McCaskill hurt, but she is now. Didn't wait long to get back in and get engaged. Got caught sleeping on the job. What do you do? You step back. Steady yourself, recompose yourself, then boom, back into it. But do not make those mistakes. This is the wrong place to fall asleep. She wasn't ready for that counter. She wasn't ready for that counter. A perfect counter lands. Missed with that right uppercut. Well, Johnny, we're in the early stages here. What have you seen so far? I've seen some fighters with a granite chin. You can hit them with a sledgehammer. They are not going to move. But then I've seen some mad punchers with a chin like a crisp. As soon as you touch them, she throws another right uppercut. As you can see, it was a hit to the head that did it. Let's watch it again. I need to see that again.
So it's onward and upward after a knockout win 